New at four, an Auburn man busted with dozens of people's mail, arrested, released, then arrested again. The second time for allegedly breaking into a home, stealing property, and spray painting derogatory words inside. CBS 13's Renee Santos is live in Auburn near Linda Drive and Panorama Way where this all happened. Renee. Yeah, it all started when the sheriff's office got a call about a man asleep in his car near these mailboxes here, and that's when deputies found all that stolen mail and stolen tools. A male full driver appears to be passed out. A man deputies identify as 33-year-old David Fuchs is accused of a wild crime spree involving stealing personal mail, tools, clothes, bedding, and a wedding band. And mail is now up and walking around. It started last Thursday when deputies first got a call about a man asleep in a car who was previously seen taking mail out of mailboxes on Linda Drive. The suspect also allegedly stole tools from a person's truck. Deputies were able to arrest the man who was found in possession of mail belonging to 23 people. He was booked and later released from custody, only to be arrested again that evening for allegedly breaking into a home, stealing property, and spray painting derogatory words on the walls and floors. We met up over here and we seen a guy from the county. He said there was a break in over there. Rebecca Reed says she saw the suspect that morning. As we, you know, all gathered our stories together, uh, we figured out that he had been going through the mailboxes and he came around here and passed out. Deputies say when the suspect was arrested the second time, he was wearing the clothes he was accused of stealing. Is a case like this where it's the same suspect hours later, is this unusual? This is rather unusual. Now, deputies say that the crimes were likely committed all before that suspect was arrested. The first time, the sheriff's office says the suspect is accused of breaking into two other homes. Coming up at 5, how deputies were able to track down this su the suspect the second time and why he was released the first time. All right. Yeah, it's a strange one, all right. Renee, thank you. Live in Auburn tonight.